My name is John Bartoletta, I'm the founder and chairman of Unation. Unation is an event and branding platform inside the social networking space. The first few years of Unation were cumbersome to say the least. Um, I found a partner, co-founder George Beardsley. He immediately um, put a team together with me and we started working on a project. But what happened is you have two guys that are not technical based and we had a rough time trying to figure out what technology company to use, especially at a time when nobody had ever developed anything this intent. So we were bringing in all the other outside social networks and bringing it all under one platform. So the vision was there, the business plan was there, the capital was there, but we had really no idea what we were doing on the technical side. But the first two years were pretty rough. George and I had to go through multiple tech facilities to try to get somebody to understand the project and then get it off the ground. Well, the pain of going through multiple mistakes with the tech groups was really frustrating because we, we are seasoned professionals. We've been in business for a long time, 22 years. And to have a failure on the tech side was just unacceptable. So we kept working through it. But it was every every 90 to 120 day cycle, George would reestablish where we were and then we'd have to start looking to outsource to other firms. And we, we, we went the gap. We went all the way to Brazil, um, all over the United States, trying to look for the right group. We heard about Van Coders through a partner of ours, but he came to the table with Van Coders after literally about 12 months of due diligence and said, I have a solution for you. And we were all ears at that point. The transitioning of uh, bringing Unation and Van Coders together really worked out very, very well. They came in with a proposal that really made us understand that it might take them four to five weeks, of which it only took them two weeks. So everything that the Van Coders was promising us, they, they really under-promised and over-delivered on every aspect of the transition. The quality of work out of Band Coders has been exceptional. They're extremely efficient, on time, meet all their deadlines. It's been the fastest development we've seen in the last four and a half years. And so it's an exciting time of not only getting the product out to market, but where we're going to go with the Band Coders and the product development as changes happen in the future. It gave a whole new breath of fresh air to the company. Underperforming tech teams really bring the financial aspect of the firm to a crawl. You're spending a lot of money. You're normally planning out uh, 30, 60, 90 days in advance with the tech team. So if they're not performing, you know you're burning money that you might not be able to get back or use. It's very frustrating. If we would have found band encoders and lined them up in the beginning, we would have probably saved three to four million dollars when you get a tech firm that delivers on everything they say they're doing, it makes us even more creative. So now we're not held back by the drag of somebody not performing. We can trust them. We know they're there for us. The meetings are always on time. They always have their work complete. And so now you can look forward and look at the vision of what we're having to do. And looking forward to other firms and what they should do if they, if they get into a position that we got ourselves into, is I would take a very hard look at the company your business structure, the financing, where you're at, and then look at tech. And if tech is in any way not delivering, you should do a hard stop. Get with the band encoders, get a plan in place, and let them go to work. Because I'm telling you, within weeks, you'll see a big turnaround in your firm.